welcome back to PJ 8 Bit. My name's James. This is Peyton. Hello, everybody. And we're about to bomb a boat. Let's do it. Bombing boats. Well, we gotta find the boiler first. Yeah. Oh, oh shit, dude. Whoa, 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 dude. That was kind of... I didn't realize this was a stealth mission. He was... Up, but... He's very stupid. That too, yeah. Did you set a timer? Oh, shit, no. <laughs> Don't watch. Don't watch us. Set a timer. Don't watch us. <laughs> Can't go that way. Where's Another? the boiler room? Yeah. That's where that dude went or came from or something. Is that a Javix bottle? Do you make bombs with bleach? Or is oh, it just a bleach bottle? It could it could be either or. I don't know. I thought it was like fertilizer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, who's there? No one. Uh, yeah, ghost. You saw something. Ooh, ghosts instead of zombies. Are you ready? Nice. Oh, he's bleeding hard. Well, he was being a pain, so I Batman hey, sleep him. This has gotta be the boy, right? Yep. Yeah. Looks like it, it. Looks yeah. Like yeah. It. yeah. Little That's knobs and stuff. There's too much stuff in the way. Maybe there's there is a lot of stuff in the way. Let's see, let's see. It's not gonna be easy getting out of here, that's for sure. Is that shit going on? No way now. Okay. Oh jeez. <laughs> okay, they're very busy, luckily. Okay, we wanna go? Just gotta guess. keep your wits about you. Yeah, I'm uh -oh. trying. Wait here. Luckily they're shooting guns, they can't hear a damn thing. Yeah, especially in a fucking metal tanker like this too. Like that'd be way louder than what it is right now. Oh yeah, that guy can't hear them at all. Oh aim, 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 aim. I go over the head if you're doing a bow. Really? Are you doing that? Okay. I'm gonna try to be better. Yeah, I was gonna say I go Wait. for the head, bro. Okay. I go for that head. I think you're trying all to be right. I think you're trying to be nice. And I appreciate it. We all appreciate your humanitarianism, <laughs> but just kick this guy's ass. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I'll be mean bitch. I'll put my mean bitch panties on. It just says he just pulled him up, you're like, <laughs> mean bitch. My mean bitch panties. So Oh yeah, he's dead. Yeah. I am sorry I tried to give you life. I like every time I kill somebody, it's like it shows us AJ. And it's like there he is. He saw it. Yeah, it's he like, saw fuck that. You. Fuck you. He's game. very influenced. <laughs> uh, the, the, there. I don't know. Like we can just make that a button. But... All right. Well. Oh, you have to keep holding. Okay, that could have been more specific. Time to live up to your name, Ruby's Revenge. Bury this thing in the bottom of the river. Once they start up this boat, we won't have much time before it explodes. How long? Not sure. An hour, 30 minutes. Let's hurry up then. Let's go fast now. Get off the boat. We gotta get the friends. Oh, great. You forgot about that part. Second level. Well, where right? are they? What are they doing right now? Second level. What are they doing in the second level? being hostages. Oh yeah, that part. My bad. I thought you... <laughs> I thought there was... Focus. Oh, jeez. Yes, ma'am. My nerve. Oh my god. I, I have a little brother. Short, scarred face. See? He's not out there, is he? Look, we've discussed this. Your family is Delta now. There ain't no room for anyone else. Yes, ma'am. She had to be the cell guard. We can't sneak past her. No, but I can Batman sleep her. Oh, are you in this? Get out. Not without our people. I swear to God, if you got ten caught up in this, just, just tell me that he's safe. Give me that. He told me to tell you. He forgives you. <sighs> Do 
I knew that would work. Can you get your arrow down? Thank you. I'll help you get everyone out. Then you take my brother and run. Get him back to where it's safe. Come on, we have to hurry. I knew that would work. Yep. Guilt card. Works every time. Oh, you fuck. Oh my god. Yeah, my you dudes. Okay? What are you doing? Card. I. Uh, yeah, I'm all right. We're all right. We're gonna get him loose first. He's. He's in rough shape. I'll help him loose. Maybe it wasn't tortured or something. I'm wondering. Oh, you don't no. have a lot of time before Doreen comes back. We're gonna have to feel bad for like shitting on Lewis all the time, aren't we? They picked the one that sings, right? Violet, mm. help me with these guys. Got it. Lewis, you okay, man? Is he? Lewis, Lewis. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> don't now. fucking point that at me. Are you fucking kidding me? Really, girl? Ugh. You gotta be kidding me. Violet, we gotta talk about your ex. Yep. Oh, oh. oh God, you okay, man? Lewis. Oh. oh. But it's okay. It's okay. Are you okay, man? What happened? He got tortured like hell. Yeah. It's okay, bud. It's okay. What did they do to you? No! 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 Don't! They, they, uh, they cut out his tongue. He just, uh, he kept fucking talking. Oh my god. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, oh, you poor guy. Oh, you did not deserve that. Yeah, I'll fuck that. these bastards pay for this. I promise you, Lewis. Shh. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, Lewis, they destroyed you. Oh, they're going to fucking die now. Yeah. That's, that's fucked to do that to somebody, especially a kid. He'll be home soon. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We're not staying here that long. Yeah, no, fuck that. What do we got? What do we got? Come on. A little bit of a gap. No, I know that. <laughs> huh? Come on, go down. Down? That. That's Looks what like I'm there's a gap here. You can yeah, talk I'm to too small to fit my hand through. You can talk to Violet, so you guys can make a plan. Or will the game not let you do that? Look through the door. Yeah, you think you can. Yeah, you can. Clem, are you all right? I'm fine. Where's AJ? Over here. <sighs> Thank God. Shit. At least we're not moving yet. Oh yeah, that's We've right. We're stuck here and they're gonna out. blow it to hell. That's right. This sucks. They can talk to them all. That's great. Vi, are you alright? I'm fine. Looking for a way out. If this thing explodes... We're fucked. I know. You doing okay in there, AJ? Yeah. I'm alright. I'm looking for a way out. Yeah, me too. The doors don't look very well made. Maybe that's something we can work with. Yeah, they're kind of rusted. Yeah, they're pretty... How are you holding up? I can't talk. If Lily... She yeah. told us not to talk. We'll be home soon. Just hang in there. Okay, good to know. Omar, are you hurt? I... Fuck. I just want I'm to just, go home. It's the sentiment, right? Yep. We will. Okay. Just to say I've talked to all of them. Yep. I know, I know, I know, I know. We'll just check in on them. I get it. Either way. Ah. So if you have something really long, you could pry that open. They can open you up. Yep. Mm -hmm. I might be able to.
able to chip away at this if I had a tool or... Damn it, they must have taken away my knife. No, of AJ, course they did. Do you still have your knife? Yeah, they didn't find it. Only the big one. Good. I need you to slide it over to me. That's smart. Damn, hell yeah, I got the knife. Oh yeah, shit, you got the knife, bro. That's perfect. Better than nothing. Oh no no no, buddy, we're not gonna cut your we're not gonna cut you at all. Don't Oh jeez, he's really gotten fucked. I feel so bad for him. Oh my god. Yeah. Chip it rest of wild, yeah. Any other strategies? Let's see what that one. I don't know if this can really help, but I'll get us out of here. I promise. <sighs> yeah, I feel for I feel for you, man. Jeez. I like that they really bring the story out of like, if this happened to this person, this is most likely how they would re probably react to that. Yep. Hey. <laughs> Whatever you doing, don't. I promise you, it ain't worth it. Step back. She awake? Yes, ma'am. Uh-oh. Good. I'll take it from here. They didn't see the knife. They didn't see it. No, but I'd hide it with your foot or something. Or kick it. <laughs> what is your deal? Where's Abel? I think she might be on our side. We killed him. We put a knife in his head. Uh, did you hear that? Like, it was- Fuck. You little monster. Damn it. We showed him mercy. Yeah, we did. He was terrified of turning, so we stopped him from having to. We gave him what he wanted. <laughs> I'm sure you did. Back up. Minerva. Open the door. Yes, ma'am. Normally, the trouble you caused, I'd shoot you and toss you overboard. So what are you doing this time? Hey, but I'm genuinely impressed. First, you organize these idiot kids into a fighting force and kill two of my most experienced soldiers. Then you sneak onto my boat under the cover of a herd. I bring a prize like you back to the Delta. It might make this whole clusterfuck of a mission worth it. Someone like you, so young with so much potential, you're far too valuable to kill. Look, if I'm the one you want, let the others go. This isn't a negotiation. This is me telling you how things are going to be. You know, my father, Larry, was a military he was man. He's a dick, actually. Yeah, keep talking, kid, keep talking, keep talking. He had all kinds of rules. The thing that bugged him most was waste. If I ever left a light on after leaving a room, <laughs> he'd flip. No matter how many times he ranted about the cost of electricity, I could never remember to hit that switch. So? So one day, he let our power get cut. He liked illustrations to show that actions have consequences. No more TV, no more hair dryer, no more ice cream sandwiches. Just a miserable family sitting in the dark. Well, I guess asshole runs in the family. Is that the consequence? That you're an asshole? The consequence is, I never left the lights on again. My father had his faults. But he showed me the effectiveness of teaching by example. Oh, is that what this is? A lesson?
I want to tell you a story. Let's call it the Parable of the Twins. Lily! Two girls were taken from their home and brought to a new place to live. They had to leave their friends and family behind, and that was hard at first. They shed a lot of tears. But the new place was a good place. The people there grew corn and raised pigs, and the twins ate well for the first time in years. They had hot showers, clean clothes, beds. They were given guns and trained to use them. The people there were kind to these girls. All that was asked in return was that they help defend the group. You see, this place had a lot of enemies, killers and thieves who wanted what they had. They needed help fighting, or they'd lose everything. Yeah, I don't build, care. Their crops, like, their power, and they're just trying to even their lives. They're just trying to brainwash the Stockholm syndrome us here. <laughs> they only do that to the ones who can't keep their mouths shut. One of the girls saw that this was a place worth fighting for, and her tears dried. But the other twin, she could never forget her old home. She rejected every gift, every opportunity, stirred up trouble every chance she got. Lily, you're sounding like a psychopath. She her sister or at least a sociopath. To and leave on the river. Of course, they didn't get far. What happened then, Minerva? I killed her. What the Jesus fuck? Jesus Christ. Minnie, no, tell me it's not true. Your own sister? Why would you do that? She was twisting my head with her lies. And? I made a mistake. I needed to show my loyalty to the place I call home. Like it or not, you're one of my people now, Clem. The question is, which twin are you going to be? The loyal one, or the dead one? What have you done to her head, you fucking psychotic bitch? You're evil! You are fucking evil! I'll be the one who breaks out at night and cuts your throat while you sleep. <sighs> kind of what I expected you to say. But you'll see, I'm not kidding around. Pull the mouthy one out of the cell. They clearly didn't get the moral of the story. We'll have to help them understand. I don't get that idea. Whoa. Don't hurt Violet, or I'll hurt you. Hey, yo, you better cool it, or you gonna get yourself hurt. Fuck no! Get off of me! Easy. Stay still. Fuck um, you now! He can take that. You can take the cleaver out of her hand. Don't yep. Make this hurt more than it has to. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh, oh, no, 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 Enough. He bit me. I said that's enough. You deserve to die. We'll kill you. You think you can kill oh, fuck me? Fuck off, girl. I know I can. Oh, he is angry, but we'll this is not going to be a fair. Lever. It's just put a knife right to the side AJ, you're not Big thinking smart. A little guy. I know I can do it. I killed Marlin. He wasn't a monster, but you are. Bang. Oh, fuck. <laughs> so you killed Marlin. Huh. Oh, great. Here we go. I bet you'd make a great soldier. Lily, please, don't hurt AJ. I'll do whatever you want. Clem seems to care a lot about you. Oh, crap. Come on, let's go have a chat. Just us. Don't you fucking touch him! Clem! No, no, please! 
Come inside! AJ! Keep an eye on her, Minerva. Lily, don't! Get this thing moving. I want to be far away from here. Fast. I'll start up the boiler. Don't. Don't you dare look at me like that. This is the only way we survive. Who are you? Fuck survival! Look at what you're doing! Minnie, please. I uh, just I'm, to I'm actually you like scared what happens next. Sorry like there's. We never searched for you. Oh, come on, go, 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 go. I'm sorry we trusted that fucker Marlin. If I ever thought there was a chance, I know. I know. Kick it right open. Hey, but Sophie's dead. I have a new. <sighs> what the hell are you doing? Wait, what? what? So she heard you. So you have to stop. You have to stop when she hears. I, I don't. How? I don't know. I did, it didn't show any sense of like, oh, she. Don't you dare look at me. I, like I didn't that. understand it either. It didn't show you any you sense of like, oh, she survive. can hear that. Who are you? I'm assuming that's what it wants. Look at what you're doing. Okay. Well, how do I do that? Okay, we'll just Please. go back and try. I'll watch it really closely this time. I'm sorry we never searched for you, for Sophie. I'm sorry we trusted that fucker Marlon. This part was fine. I, ever I never cared about this part. Okay. okay. Did you so miss it? Hit up. I have. You all need to understand. This is the only way. Yeah, I just went way. quick enough. That's all. Oh, weird. Okay. Stay in line, or you die. The people you love die. You killed your own sister, you man. Ram the damn live. door. All of you. Oh fuck. Grab her weapon. Yeah. I kick her and grab the weapon. Oh. Behind you. Yeah, I would have grabbed the weapon. You're the fucking problem here. Whoa! God. That was close. Come on, hit that Q button, bro. Hit that Q button. She was a more convenient key than this one. Oh God! Yeah, you're doing you're going to double tap that key now. Yeah, yeah I'm getting ready. I'm 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 ready. I'm
Don't shoot him. Oh, they're gonna shoot him. They're gonna fucking shoot him. No, not James. Not my character. <laughs> not me. No. No. You don't fucking scare me. Is that so? Force your ways onto others because you're afraid. Because you're weak. Oh, he's calling it like it is. I give my people a cause to fight for. Don't you force a cause for the them to fight for. The thing about people like him, AJ, is that they're too broken to fit into a community. They won't fight for anyone but themselves. Kill it. No! What the fuck? Easy there, Tan. Don't hurt him. Just stop hurting people. Please. Shooter! <laughs> Why don't we all just take a breath, all right? Give me my friends back. Put down the gun. Let them go. All oh, of us. Christ. Or, or else. Fine. Go ahead then. Do it. Save your friends. That's what you came here to do, isn't it? <laughs> oh, I see. L Lily, you're a fucked up person, man. Everybody's got this he's going, difference. He, he's like, going. You're not a soldier either. Please don't. No. He doesn't give a shit. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get in there. Get in there. Fuck you, Lily. Get the gun. Get the gun. Oh. There we go. There we go. Oh fucking god. Oh. The damn hair. Fuck yeah! Hit, 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 hit. Come on! Hit, hit. Eat! Oh, shit. Shit, eat! Oh, there we go! I'm sorry to backseat game, but God, I'm nervous. No, it's okay. I noticed! God, I'm nervous! Jesus, go, go, go! Oh! God. God damn it. God damn it. I hope our neighbors don't hate us. They probably do. Yeah. It's midnight, guys. Oh, is it really? Oh, it is. Oh, God. It's Saturday. Or Friday. I don't know what day it is. It's Friday. Oh, God. Come on. Come on. Kick it again. Yeah, Come well, on, you cannot be- My name be is right now, I forget what day it is. This shit's happening, stabbed her in the leg, but she's not dying fast enough, no. This is going a boss fight. Oh. AJ. Aim for the head. Wait! I give up! I will give up! Oh, shit. Put down the gun! I'll let everyone leave! My crew and I will leave! We won't bother you anymore! Oh. What do you AJ. think? She's not a threat. Lower the gun. You weren't down there. You didn't see what she did. She cut my friend's tongue out. <laughs> you don't have to do this, please. It's a trick. Don't you fucking dare, AJ. Just give me the gun. I can't let her hurt anyone else. I don't want to die. Cheers! Lower the gun, AJ. <laughs> I, didn't know what to do. I know I didn't know what to do either. I was just like, just choose something. I hope it's not bad. Okay. He's gonna die. She's gonna stab him right behind the back. Maybe. I fucking said it. I fucking said it. I fucking said it. Fuck. God damn it. I was wondering if we should just kicked her ass. I wondered that too. Oh, great. I, I, that's why uh. I struggled. I was going to talk about it, and then it just happened, and I was like, okay, well, I guess this is... Shit, the bomb! AJ, AJ! Oh, God! Oh. Oh, my God. We got an achievement called Leader. Are you, are you making fun of us? Profession- Okay, I'm gonna tell you something, game. We have bloody internet. Our computer is literally connected by ethernet. 
Ethernet, whatever the hell it's called. Okay. Wow, okay. Minerva, my, Mia, was stunned when you told Marlon killed Brody. She was dejected when you said Ten would be ashamed to call her sister. And she felt heartsick after learning Ten forgave her. Well, you should feel heartsick, honestly. Kind of a bitch. Lily was unfazed by your threat to kill her after she tried to threaten you into cooperation. She felt smug when you stopped AJ from shooting her. Yeah, I should just shot the bitch. Yeah, I know. Abel felt ashamed, felt assured when you promised him mercy. We've been we've been pro life though, eh? Like ultimately our choices. It's just been the consequences of people manipulating the situations that getting people dead. Yep. We've I been try trying to make the best choice. Guys. Peyton got me killed. Peyton got me killed. This is not good. Look at, look at, look at the poor boy. Look at him. But he was elated when he said that there might be more walkers. Oh. Violet felt romantic after you danced together. Violet was touched that you wanted to hear why she was sent to Erickson. Because she wanted, she wanted you to know, wanted, yeah. she wanted you to want that. Violet felt understood after you expressed sympathy about her reason for coming to Erickson. Violet was thankful when you let AJ stop Dorian from cutting off her finger. Jesus. Oh God, AJ. Uh, this boy doesn't give a- he never gets a win, does he? AJ felt conflicted after you killed Abel, sparing him from turning. Um, AJ felt defeated when you said there was no way to prove you could be together as walkers. I know, but I don't know what to say about that, honestly. This is all negative, eh? AJ felt yeah. helpless when he spared Lily only to have her kill James. He felt helpless, defeated, and conflicted. Yikes. Yikes, indeed. Yikes forever. Yeah. Lewis was traumatized after his time spent with the Raiders, I'm sure he was. Yep. And, and he was terrified by your promise to fight back against the Raiders. Uh, he was just, he was destroyed. Just, yeah. Ten, Ten was grateful when you stood up for him against Willie. He was grateful when you promised to tell Minerva you forgave her. Rosie is worried about everybody. <laughs> Willie was excited that you wanted to name the bomb at all. Uh, Ruby was proud you did not recognize her official Erickson evaluation. Aww. Oh, that's nice. Omar is... And there am I, because they're both on the boat, and we don't know who got off the boat. We could take a wind chimes? That'd be nice. Aww. Oh, we need to sketch. We always get like two out of six. We fucked up with that too. We fuck up with that. Not every we time. We have such cute things. I know. I'm, I'm upset about it. We have finally a home and we can decorate it with <laughs> oh. such cute things and I can't find them. Oh. No. Game? You okay? <clears throat> oh, well. It's dead. Good job. Thanks. Oh my god. Uh, that is was right? emotionally draining. <laughs> That would that that yeah God it's such a been this has been such a ride today oh no oh look why are we just seeing a hat well, I has that hat on right now but it's backwards why are we just seeing the hat why is it just the hat because <sighs> death to all take us back take so so what would have happened if we shot Lily then because then now it's feeling like Lily's gonna be the big boss at the end but what would have happened if we shot her. Oh my god, so many questions. I got so many questions. But fuck, what a ride, eh? Peyton Run, the last episode! The problem with people like Lily is you cut off the head and, like, there's still some asshole that's gonna take the place. You know what I mean? Well, like, she's going by uh, a... She's going by a a way of thinking that is like a virus. It, like, you know, yeah, if you're, exactly. you, yeah. you know, you just want to live life easier. You don't want to try to live by any philosophy. You just want to live easily. Yeah. So you just kind of join a group and who, you know, and it doesn't matter what you do. It's, it's always uh, justified by the fact that, well, we make it better for everybody. Again, it's that same philosophy that we talk about every time. What is it? Uh, God, now I can't remember. It's, I don't know if you guys know what we're talking about. The idea of like, we always find this in like, especially with movies with heroes, um, the hero tends to be more based on the duty. So the duty, um, so the action itself has to be always a morally good thing. It's not about the consequence. Whereas the villains are always about the, you know, the consequence. You know what I mean? 
um, not necessarily the thing that they're doing. So they always like justify their actions as being good because of the consequence it, it does, even if the action might be like killing somebody or something. Yeah. So your typical hero will yeah. try to save one for over the many, where I, it's the it's utilitarianism. That's it. Yeah. That's and 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 deontology. Deontology yeah. is the one for that. It's the actual duty itself. Yeah. That's 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 got to be morally good. It's more important than the consequence. But the uh, utilitarianism, the utility of the action, that's the one where it's more about the consequence. So Lily's very much a dean. Uh, it's a utilitarianist here. She's taken, but she's taken that very wimpy, you know, chickeny way out with utilitarianism. Like a, a lot of villains are based on that kind of idea. I find. Yeah, like a and lot it's, of it's them. like, oh, but hers is like, oh, this is for the greater good if we all suffer. <laughs> yeah. Well, just if we just force this uh, will on everybody, everyone, yeah. will, and we just put everybody in line and conform to this, it's, it's we'll a be very, happy. Yeah, it's, 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 I'd say, a mixed kind of thing because there's, there's also, to the sense of if this one person makes a sacrifice, it creates an, you know, an infinitely better world for everybody. That's the Matrix concept. It's a little different. It's the Matrix concept. It's the idea of, unpl- you know, just plugging into something and, you know, and because it feels good or it's easier. It's convenient. It's it's convenient. We have been all about the concept of conveniency. Yeah. People will do anything, anything for anything to anything for a con- few minutes in their day for convenience. Anything for convenience, even if it sacrifices like your moral choices in a day. It's amazing and disgusting how much people sacrifice for convenience. Yeah, I think that is what this game is getting at right here too. How much Lily is ready to sacrifice everybody's lives for just convenience of a better life. Even if it is for a group of people. Yeah. It's just, oh man. Yeah. Any like last thoughts, Peyton? Like at the end of that whole. I think that that's... scene with Lee. I know that wasn't this episode. Was it oh, this episode? Yeah. Yeah, it was. Okay. Yeah. Like not like not this particular recording, but it was this there was episode three. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So it was the last record. We we did two of these in a row, so yeah. forgive me. Um Fuck. <laughs> yeah, that was an emotional. Fuck. Sh- that, that actually really hurt. It really hurt. Holy to feel that. shiznit. Uh, I, I feel for Clementine. I don't <sighs> that know. her. I, I love the fact that they're in this game. They're all about realism. Like trying to make it like, how would you fathom anything being in this world? How would you look into this in a way of like, how can I morally keep myself going? How can I hold on to anything? And he, she's just holding on to Lee. You know, like she's just, she just, it's like that one pure thing that she had in her life. The one pure thing, you know what I mean? And AJ is like the other pure thing. And it's, it's sad to see because it's like AJ is getting tainted and tainted and tainted. And it's just, it's not, it's not Clementine's fault. It's just, there's so much to understand. And even adults don't really understand. Hell, I don't even know if I fucking understand. I'm just another guy too. But it's just, yeah. but you see the taintness, you see the, the toxic, uh, uh, mind of thought and just spreading everywhere. It's so hard. Yeah, it is hard. I, yeah, I felt I really felt the rawness with with Clementine and her struggle in this world with those little flashbacks. It really hurts, man. It really hurts. Well, because at the end of the day, what you're trying to teach is safety, but in like survival. But like, yeah, there's people yeah. like Lily who complicate that concept, right? And yeah. How do you teach that to a kid? How do you explain that gray area or like I, that I don't to know. their kid? I don't know. I don't but know. That's I'm... the thing. And that's why I was just like, I don't want to say don't shoot her because I think that might confuse him, but it might be the best thing to for do him. In the, well, it's like, because you're trying to judge the situation as a gamer. What's yeah. the best, right? Again, it goes back to you. And what it... other people are going to do. Like, could somebody have jumped out? I don't know. Well, I think what the game's trying to press with you teaching AJ is that deontology concept. Like, you know what I mean? Like, so, like, the games always complicate your choices by going, like, are you going to do what's best for the, the later consequences, or are you going to do what's best, what feels right right now? And that's the deontology versus utilitarianism, right? True. So, what they're doing is they're pushing the deontology uh, guilt by throwing AJ into the mix. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, it makes it even harder to make that choice. And that's exactly what happened there. And you f- you kind of sat to the deontology concept of, uh, the well, we got, we you know, we got to teach them what's right here. But I'm not gonna lie. In that moment, I, I was right there with you. But when you sit back and think about it, like fuck, I can't trust Lily at all. Like the first time we were with her, she shot somebody out the fucking blue, and nothing popped up that really 
made it necessary for her to shoot somebody like that. Yeah. It was totally sociopathic, psychopathic, whatever it is, tendencies. It was just out of the blue. It's like she was just a murderous piece of shit. Like, so I do not trust her at all. No, I wouldn't. She's a snake. Uh, and that, she, yeah. sorry, Sal, I know you're out right we, now. We, too. we have a snake. We have a snake. So it's like hard when we help people um, Yeah. <laughs> you gotta ref- yeah. God damn it, Peyton. <laughs> I gotta replace that. Anyway. Um, but she's a bitch. Okay, can we talk about Minerva, though? How yeah. Angie. <laughs> well, that's Stockholm Syndrome, right? That's what that is. I Is it? Isn't it? Stockholm Syndrome, I think, is... I don't know the exact definition. No, no, I'm not a psychologist, but, but like... But I'm, I'm kind of... Is it? <laughs> like... What do you mean? I, I wonder if there's something else going on there. Like, okay, sure, it's Stockholm Syndrome. Oh, you mean jealousy but over that, Clementine? But would Stockholm Syndrome cause you to kill your own sibling like that? Yeah, possibly. Depends how far deep you are. True. They cut his tongue out. I don't know what else they're willing to do to people to keep their way of life. Yeah, true. Like, they probably tortured the shit out of her. We just didn't see that because that was a year ago. Remember? Like, that was a year ago. So she might look fine right now, but But, she might have burns on her back. We don't fucking know. Right. What were you, what was your argument though? Just to kind of play the game a little bit. Like, what, what, how, why do you think that she was doing those things? I I wondered a little if there was, like, well, no, because she did seem shaky with everything. It's just, that's a huge... You just didn't buy it, eh? Yeah, it's a huge jump. I was kind of like, you're just a jelly bitch who just wants to kill me. I took it as jealousy. You totally could be right. I, there was a bit of like a, because that was the old, that was the ex-girlfriend, right? Yeah. Yeah. So it's kind of interesting how like, I don't know if she found out about Clementine, but maybe she noticed, you know what I mean? That's what I mean, be picking up in behaviors. Maybe. I'm not going to lie though. I think the game was also trying to paint that picture of how crazy Lily is supposed to be. True. I think they're, True. especially with her sitting down and being all like, and being all like, you know, you're at checkmate right now, right? You know that, right? You know, you totally weren't, but. Yeah. And just trying to like to convince you and be like, you know, just come on, just save yourself. I mean, you know, you're, you're fucked, so. Yeah. Be fucked in the right way. <laughs> be fucked in the right way. Yeah, it's the, it's the most fucked up It's the up motto way. of the week. Be fucked in the right way, everybody. Akuna Matata, don't worry about it. <laughs> wow, it's a dark version of Akuna Matata. <laughs> well, means no worries for the rest of your days. <laughs> when your dad gets murdered. No Some worries. Free, free <laughs> philosophy. That's a, one, that's a hard one to say. Okay, we better get going because we're losing our goddamn minds. See you later, guys. Bye-bye. We Thank you so much for watching, oh, as yes. always. And uh, again, we're going to finish this. What are you doing the princess Queen wave? Way. Yeah, you're doing the weird princess wave or something. Um, <laughs> we're going to finish this. Uh, thank you, though. Remember to subscribe. I can barely say that word anymore, but hit that button. Problem free philosophy. Try it three times fast. Go. Problem free philosophy. Yeah, problem free philosophy. Uh, we're getting it okay, but I do see that. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. We'll see you next video, guys. All right. See you later. Bye bye. Bye bye. Just like vibrate. Bye. The meme of you. No, not that one. <laughs> I don't know which one you're talking about. The one where it's like I thought, you. What was the dog one? It's though? like you and that angry bird that yeah. Tucker made of you. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, bring that up in the next video because like we won't be won't be full screen right now. We'll we'll put it in the next full screen. Though. You right. bring you bring that up in the next video. That's beautiful. I we have a meme. Someone, a friend took a picture of me.